Match well played. How was that for you then? A hard-earned point against Oxford? Uh, hard-earned, but I felt like we were good value for a, w a win tonight, really. Um, I felt we were the dominant team overall. Um, and we had a few chances to go and get that win, but wasn't to be tonight. But the lads showed some good togetherness tonight and we you know, put in a decent performance, I thought. Tough to fall behind in the manner that you did after the, the bright start that you'd made as well? Yeah, I felt like we started really well. You know, we were on the front foot. Um, you could say, see they were taken aback um, in the first 10 minutes, 15 minutes. And it, the goal was kind of against the run of play, wasn't it? Um, which was unfortunate. We, we knew they were a team of shooters and um, unfortunately we, we've given them time to have a shot and it goes in the back of the net, um, which was a shame. But, you know, we did well to get back in the game and uh, we had chances to win it. Yeah, second half, you, your force out keeper into quite a few saves, didn't you? Your sense to goal was, was about to come, the pressure you were building? Yeah, definitely. We felt like we had quite a few corners, chances. Um, yeah, momentum was building and, you know, thankfully we got a goal and I felt like we could have gone and got the next one. And the goal came from your good self, at yeah. Matt. What about that, back on back on the score sheet? Yeah, uh, I'm just trying to sniff goals out, you know, this season. I've got three this year, which is, which is good and I'm hoping to get more. Um, yeah, so I, I'm glad to get a goal, yeah. Just, yeah, describe that feeling when the ball ends up in, in the back of the net after you've flicked it goalwards. Yeah, I'm just, just buzzing to get the lads back in the game because we were working so hard and uh, I felt like we, we deserved it. And um, yeah, just, just glad that we could get that for, for the team, you know, to get back in the game and, um, and not get beat tonight. Um, so, you know, we couldn't win the game, but we didn't get beat, which is positive. You know, we moved forward a few places, keep a bit of momentum. And um, yeah, so... A decent night overall. Yeah, it's so tight, isn't it? So congested, the, the league table. You're back in the top half, which, which, which must be nice when, when you look at the, the table and see yourself in back in that top half of uh, the League One table. Yeah, definitely. You know, it, it gives us confidence, um, especially like the last couple of seasons. We haven't seen that, and uh, it gives the boys confidence to, to go again. And hopefully we can, you know, rest and recover the next couple of days. Quick turnaround for Barnsley on, on Saturday. Um, and we need to put in a performance then and get you know get the three points hopefully. Yeah, it is a very quick turnaround. What's your thoughts on that? I, I know it is what it is. You, you, you've got to go again so quickly. It's quite a demanding schedule this week. Yeah, you know it is demanding. But from the week we had the other week when we had Plymouth and Portsmouth away and we put in you know big shifts in that in them in that week, I feel like you know the lads are in a good shape to to do it again on Saturday. You know, there's no reason why we can't. Um, it's, it's not as hard a week as it was the other week when we were travelling as well. Um, so we're at home, we can go home, rest, recover for the next couple of days um, and then get ready to go again and, and run around on, on Saturday. Well played tonight. Thanks for your time, Matt. Cheers, thank you.